Hello South Africa. It's Wednesday 23rd, February 2022 and here is the sports highlight. Springbok duo set to leave sale. Where will they head next? It is believed that Diego is likely to return to South Africa for family reasons, with the South African having reliably learned that the Stormers are indeed in talks with the lock about possibly bringing him back from Manchester, while Springbok teammate Da Klerk is likely to have several big money offers to consider. Premiership clubs are having to deal with a reduced £5 million salary cap, which sale boss Alex Anderson told the Times would make it very difficult for the English team to match any offer the clerk receives from a Japanese or French club. Faf isn't contracted to us next season and that is an ongoing discussion, Sanderson explained. The most difficult thing about the reduced salary cap is that you want to keep them all, but you can't. Even if you do want to keep them, you are not going to be offering them as much as a French club or a Japanese club. It has been pretty brutal and it is part of the job. Faf hasn't left yet but the reality is that he could get offered £1 million from Japan and that is the nature of the game. That challenge of fitting into the salary cap is quite exciting, but it is not numbers on a page, it is summer's life and aspirations. Players have a finite time in their career and need to get paid market value, or somewhere near, and if we can't deliver that then I cannot control it. De Jaeger, still only 29, is reportedly keen to head back to Mzensi having joined the Sail Sharks shortly after the Springboks won the 2019 Rugby World Cup title in Japan. Prior to his move to the Sail Sharks, he was an integral member of the Bull squad. However, the Jaeger's two-year stay in Manchester has been beset with injuries and in that time he's made on 19 appearances for the club. This is Luke for the South African.